Good morning. Uh, Tuesday, Tuesday morning, the market be on Glastonbury. It's having a little rumination. I was, um, I am just about to play a tune that I've been working on. It's an old tune, but being resurrected, it's quite timely. It's called "Get Back on Your Horse." Um, I've been putting little segments of it out, and I've just managed to sort of plot it out, so compose it from start to finish. I had a nice time with a friend working on the vocal harmonies. Uh, we've had a little bit of blue sky, and then it's the first time for about, well, yesterday we had a little bit, and then it's about a week of solid grey carpet. Grey is the new blue. That's uh, the new saying. It's sort of a little bit tongue-in-cheek, but seemingly a bit real you know for some reason you know there's a good new song called chemtrails out on vigilante.tv um you know i never know really know who i'm speaking to because uh the engagement thing i've got a few you know we've got a few trusted people um but just for example uh i went to a night a palestinian uh, benefit at the red brick building and then uh, they were sending cans of cola that had Palestine written on as Palestine cola. Obviously, they're doing it to make a bit of money to send like real food to the people. And was, they, it was arranged by these lovely old ladies, um, Mendip, friends of Palestine, I think. And then there were some artists, some Bristol artists, friends of Palestine, that came down to play the music and some Palestinians teaching this dance, the Dabka. And then it just reminded us, you know, that the... We're often just talking and looking at the devastation, the bombs dropping, the whole place, you know, turned to rubble, um, counting how many people have died, how many children have died, you know. But it's, it's a whole culture. It's like a, an ethnic eradication. You know, people use the word genocide, people, ethnic cleansing. It's like they're taken out. This, this place is like thousands of years old, a couple of thousand years old. It's a, the amount of work that it goes in, you know, you try building a house, building a road, building a garden, holding down a job, creating a family, building a guitar, cooking dinner, preaching a sermon, reading a book, writing a book. Knitting or crocheting a hat, developing relationships, on and on it goes. Obliterated, one bomb, you know, and the rhetoric and the talking about how people talk about it. Just, oh, it's fine when you're thousands of miles removed, spouting some sort of narrative. It doesn't matter who's doing what to whom. It's this massive wrong behaviour. And in all cultures, most people are all right. Most people are just getting on with their lives. So to mash up a culture, total devastation is wrong. So that's what the benefit was about. Um, so meanwhile, in my little world, I've wrote a song called Get Back On Your Horse. It's a kind of reggae tune. Kind of, you know. It's got that lilt. It's lovely. It's a lovely tune. Uh, I'm going to play it in a minute. I haven't had a, a talk to, but this is what's been going on in my life. You know, I've got... The other thing that's come up this morning is I've got some really good friends. I've not drunk alcohol for 20 months. You know, I had a dove fully into shamanic partying for a few years once my kids had kind of left home and didn't really need dad to come and pick them up and look after them because they got all their mates. And I was like, oh, a bit freer again. And then suddenly it's just like real hedonistic times, good times, I fucking parted my ass off, danced my nuts off, loved it. Chased women, drank loads, necked loads, you know, went out there. And then you realise as you're getting older, it all starts to hurt a little bit. And I'm really, really enjoying 
out on my bike, cycling, yes, my yoga, my meditation have become my dailies now. Like I say, I haven't drunk for a good while. Stop smoking tobacco again, albeit I didn't smoke for 20 years once. So like a little a little sip of uh, lovely homegrown ganja that's, you know, just got all that lovely, lovely vibe. Don't, don't abuse it, just have a little inspiration like Bob Marley or what have you. You know, because we are human after all, we've got to enjoy some things in this life. All things, hopefully. But speaking up for when our brothers and sisters, fathers, mothers, children, are getting mashed up and dying. You know, it's just... So, point being, I made a post, posted this can of cola, posted the sheets that these old ladies had detailed the goings-on. But it's not my... It's not a picture of my breakfast, of me scrambled egg with salmon in it. So there's no real engagement. You know, any posts I've made about what's going on over there, I don't think I've had one like, and I ain't doing it for likes. I'm just trying to get the message out. But I do notice that people sort of go, oh, 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 oh don't mention the war, you know. Fucking pathetic. Fucking pathetic, man. Unbelievable. Oh, look at that lovely plate of food. It's like, just an example. And even like, oh, yeah, I like your latest song. I love your latest riff. Great, I do this because I love it. It's what I've got to give. It's what I've spent the best part of 40 years pretty much daily doing. So I'm quite good at it. You know, I mean, it's down to taste, isn't it? But I, I enjoy it. It's one of the gifts I have to give to the world. But the fact that we won't, can't engage and can't acknowledge, Instagram is fucking awful. Awful. The, the denial. Well, certainly on my feed, you know, lots of really lovely people that I know. My post, because I mention it and mentioning it, might not get out there. You might not, most people might not be seeing them. Most people don't want to know. Yeah? You've built homes, you've built friendships, you've knitted hats, made luthier guitars, gone to athletics meets, gone to see your kids in their Christmas play, have worked their hearts out, off to you know to do the do the play, to you know, making clothes, whatever. But there's a bunch of people that we don't know. Most of those people, innocent, beautiful, lovely people, and have been absolutely devastated. And the new government in America, every single person has had to sign an APAC agreement, which means allegiance to Israel. And we all stand by and watch, not all, obviously, not all. I'm not having a go at anyone specifically. I'm just noticing that if I mention anything, no one really engages with it. No one's interested or embarrassed to a bit like the whole fucking covid scam the pandemic oh don't mention it oh, don't... you know things have been weird since then super weird you know i don't see many people i love seeing people in my community cycling out my bike saying hello to the shopkeepers you know but it's so divisive things are so divisive so have a bit of courage, people. It's like those old ladies who got the Palestinian benefits together. They're 80. They've got more courage than most able-bodied, strong young men and women that might look beautiful, might be getting thousands of likes on Instagram and TikTok, you know, showing their wares, you know, oh, look at my, yeah, of course, great, you look beautiful, well, of course, you've got a beautiful body, well done, and that's a whole load of programming, you know, it's like, what's inside, what comes out of there, what we share, you know, we're so addicted to all, all the, all the small things, whether it's the alcohol, whether it's the sex, whether it's the drugs, whether it's the motor, whether it's the money, and while we're addicted and chasing all that, we're turning a blind eye to what's really going on and the devastation. And that's not okay. 
the devastation in Palestine. The way my friend Max Egan, I don't know him personally, but I've been watching his videos for a dozen, you know, a dozen years or more. Said so like, be careful, yeah, because the way of Palestine will be the way of the world. So we better wake the love up, man. Listen me song. I'll do that while my coffee's still got a bit of warmth in it. Get back on your horse. Cause I still hurt, mask my true intention. No room for a bleeding heart that's missing a soul reflection. Biding my time, letting our wounds heal. No, there's a bigger picture of you through what I feel. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get up and on your shoes. Take a walk, no more to lose. Found your feet in life, a drink and dancing, feeling free and loose. Get back on your horse, up and break some laws. Get back on your horse, some rules are meant to be broken. Get back on your horse. No, you can stay the course, so get back on your horse. Rise up, you're a force of nature, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. la, 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 yeah, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. la, 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 la. Really like to write some lyrics that are joyful. Plowing through sorrow. God, I've had a summer full. If you feel kicked when you're down, get up, give it back. Own your own stuff. Take up the slack. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Get up on your shoes. Take a walk, no more to lose. Bound your feet and life a treat when you're dancing, feeling free and loose. Get back on your horse, up and break some laws. Get back on your horse, some rules are meant to be broken. Get back on your horse, you know you can stay the course. So get back on your horse, rise up, you're a force of nature. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, 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 la 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 la, yeah. We all fall sometimes into the valley With a little bit of fool and a little bit of wisdom We can climb another mountain And through all these times you find out who your friends are In the great paradox of life that brings sunshine to your winter Whoa, 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 whoa La, 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 la Get up, put on your shoes Take a walk, no more to lose Found your feet and life a treat when you're dancing, feeling free and loose. Get back on your horse, up and break some laws. Get back on your horse, some rules are meant to be broken. Get back on your horse, you know you can stay the course. Whoa, get back on your horse, rise up, you're a force of nature. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, 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 
la 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 Come on, the Palestinians. Keep that spirit. Come on, humanity. Keep the love. Loads of love. Thanks for listening if you got this far. <laughs>